in this question we need to find the area bounded by y square is equal to 9x, x is equal to 2 and x is equal to 4. Along with it, x x is in the first quadrant. To find this area, first we will draw the graph. So first equation is y square is equal to 9x. In class 11th chapter, I think it is 10 or 11, conic section, we have learned that uh, y square is, is equal to 9x is the equation of parabola. So use the definition of parabola. First we will find some of the points so we can draw it easily. Equation is y square is equal to 9x. X, plug x is equal to 0, we will get y is equal to 0. Plug x is equal to 1. When we plug x is equal to 1, we get 9 ones are 9. And root of 9 will plus minus 3. So these are the points. So first point lies on the origin. When x is equal to 1, y is equal to plus 3 and minus 3. So this is x is equal to 1. And uh, 1, 2, 3, y can be this thing. And here be minus 3. So this is this type of parabola will form. We get it from this points. After that, x is equal to 2. So here will x is equal to 2. So draw a line of x is equal to this is x is equal to 2. And x is equal to 4. This is x is equal to 4. Along with it, x axis. So this is x axis. This is x axis. And in first quadrant. So we need to find the area of first quadrant only. So we need to find this area. To find this area, we have the limits. So first we will have the required area. Let's take some naming. A, B, C and D. Area of A, B, C, D. Use integration. Here, on x axis, we have two values. Uh, we want to find area under this curve from point 2 to point 4. So lower limit will 2 and upper limit will 4. And these points are lying on the x axis. So we will take dx here and y will here. dx because limit on x axis. Now plus the value of y. Calculate y. y will root 9x and uh, it will 3 root x. We are taking only positive value. Because area cannot be negative. 2 to 4 and plug the value 3 root x dx. Now integrate it. 3. What is the integration of root x? In previous question I have teach that integration of root x will x power 3 by 2 divided by 3 by 2. 4 and This 2 will move in numerator. So we will get here 2 by 3. I have taken 2 by 3 by 2 outside the bracket. And this 2 will move in numerator. So we will get 2 by 3. 2 by 3 x power 3 by 2 minus. Uh, sorry. I plug the value. x is equal to 4. So 4 power 3 by 2 minus 2 power 3 by 2. 3 will cancel out. So after solving it we will get 2, 4 power 3 by 2 will 2 square into 3 by 2. We can write 4 as a square of 2. 2 power 3 by 2 we can write 3 by 2 as 1 plus 1 by 2. Two into this 2 will cancel out 2 power 3 will 8 minus 2 plus 1 by 2. So we can write it 2 into root 2. 2 power 1 will 2. When there is plus sign in powers, it convert into multiply. So 2 power 1 multiplied by 2 power 1 by 2. And 2 power 1 by 2 will root 2. Plus convert into multiply. Now multiply by 2. We will get 8 minus 4 root 3 unit square. This is our required. 